Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to be talking about how fluoroquinolone antibiotics messed my body up. So, a bit of a backstory here, I had surgery three times to repair a torn muscle, and um, I had multiple surgeries because there was an infection in the suture anchors, and it got cleared out, but for some reason I was prescribed this uh, ciprofloxacin antibiotic, which is a fluoroquinolone antibiotic. Now, these are some of the most toxic antibiotics of all time, so that is one thing to be, you know, a little bit worried about, but I wasn't warned at all whenever I got this. The pharmacy that I got it from didn't warn me. The doctor didn't warn me. I didn't know what I was getting myself into, so I started taking this antibiotic like I did with all the other antibiotics that I was taking prior to this, and for some reason, my whole body just got really painful. It was like, like I'm 26 years old and it felt like my body aged and I was 80 years old, which is very odd. Like I needed help going up and down stairs, which is not something that a healthy 26 year old should have to, you know, go through. Um, but I was really confused and I kind of realized that the only thing I changed was started to I started taking this antibiotic and my whole body just started to get wrecked. Um, I ended up taking another dose of it because I didn't really know any better. I just thought, I didn't even consider this to be the, the reasoning. Um, my ankles got really tight. They're still tight to this day and painful. And my calves were like getting really sore. Like it, I could barely stand up. It was hurting and I felt really weak and I needed support or else I wouldn't be able to stand up. Which then I started to get really worried because I was like, what is going on with my body? Uh, so I looked into ciprofloxacin and all the other fluoroquinolone antibiotics and I found out that they are extremely toxic to the body and they can cause a lot of <laughs> adverse effects, which I had no idea going into this because I, for some reason, was not warned about this. Um, usually at the pharmacy, they give you like sheets talking about it, but this one wasn't really like, you know, they didn't give it to me. So I was a little bit confused what was going on. Um, looking into it, found out it was the antibiotics. So I had to call my doctor's office and... They told me to stop taking it, but the unfortunate part about fluoroquinolones is that they're in your body for a very long time. So I took this and I, four months later, I'm still dealing with some of the adverse effects. So it's just what it is with these kind of antibiotics. Uh, but the biggest symptom I noticed was in my lower body. My um, calves were really, really tight. Like, like they were, it was like I worked it, worked them out every single day extremely like they had doms almost like delayed onset muscle soreness but they were you know I didn't do anything I was recovering from surgery at that point so it, it didn't make any sense I couldn't stand up I couldn't even go up and down stairs my Achilles tendon was sore and upon some further research I found out that fluoroquinolones are linked with uh increased chance of tearing your Achilles tendon which after like I had the whole surgery because of a muscle tear a tendon muscle tear so this freaked me out even further. So the it took about three months for the symptoms to go away mostly, but I still feel it to this day. And this is four months later, but I was looking online. I've read stories about people that ended up in wheelchairs from taking this. So it's kind of a scary antibiotic. Um, I wasn't warned and I feel like I probably should have been warned regarding this, but I was just doing what I was told. I was just trying to get better. Like I was in the hospital for five months. I was just trying to get better, but this thing screwed me up more than anything else I've ever taken has. Uh, it was really strange. I didn't expect my body to get so like shut down from this, but it happened. So I just wanted to make this video kind of talk about fluoroquinolones and what they can do to the body. Uh, I'm not a doctor, but if you're having issues with it, you should go see your doctor, talk to them. They'll know a lot more. Um, but yeah, it's an incredibly dangerous, like, it's just dangerous. It hurt me. I'm still impacted by it. And yeah, I'm not a fan of <laughs> having to take this. And I only took two doses. So I'm still feeling it. So yeah, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like and subscribe button below. And I'll see you in the next video.